the NSU Basketball and the NSU Sports Network. Welcome back to Joe Eccles Hall as Hopkins goes to the free throw lines for two shots after the foul. The second foul called on Kevin Douglas makes the first as Alex Isolovich checks in for the first time. Excuse me, as Hawkins nails both free throws for the Spartans. He has four points. All four coming from the free throw line in the Spartans now trail by 4, 15 to 11. Near turnover in the back corner will be turned over as Johnson has it in lane. Lays it up with the left hand and good. For Rob, that's his first field goal. The Spartans now trail by two, 15 to 13. That quickly comes Cannon. He lays it up and good. Cannon, 4-4 four four from the fl floor. He has eight points. He averages 16 on the day as Rasheed Gaston checks in for the first time for Norfolk State. 17-13, your score. Norfolk State trailing by four as Fuentes has it. Left wing now. Looking for a ball screen. Gets it. Rolls right with the right hand. Goes behind his back. Gets into the lane. Kicks it out to Rob Johnson, top of the key. Johnson looking inside for Rasheed Gaston. Ball knocked away, but a foul's going to be called. That foul's going to go against Johnson. But Johnson, that's going to be his first. Team's fifth on the night. As Anthony White will check in. Taking the seat will be Isolovich. Quick opportunity to play there for Isolovich, and he takes a seat. As the Spartans inbound, comes into the hands of Rasheed Gaston. Gaston hands it off to Fuentes. Fuentes looking inside, can't get it there. Here's Fuentes, left wing. Fuentes kicks it off to Johnson. 15 footer, left baseline, shots up, knocks it down. Four points now for Rob Johnson. He scored the last four for the Spartans. It's now a two point lead for St. Francis at 17, 15, 14 minutes ago here in the first set with the basketball. Here's Callaway, dribbles, gets it off into the hands of Cannon. He hands it and finds White. White drives to Lane, lays it up off the glass, no good. Rebound comes down to the hands of Rasheed Gaston. He's fourth in the Miak and rebounding thus far for the freshman. That quickly, Fritz drives down Lane, shuts up and good, and he's five. That's going to be the second field goal for Jamel Fuentes. He has four points, and we're tied up at 17 with 13, 38 left to go here in the first half. As Zaik Estimate checks in, taking the seat will be Chris Brown. Also checking in for the Terriers will be Matt Milk. He will take the place of Akeem Johnson. Fuentes goes to the free throw line for one shot. It is up and it is good. Three point play completed. The Spartans take their first lead of the afternoon at 18 17 with 13 38 left to go here in the first half. Back quickly. St. Francis in the backcourt gets trapped at the half court line. Good trap there by Estime and Hawkins. And the timeout is going to be called 